I've been with the museum over 18 years. And I started out in security, went up to design, and worked in several other departments, now with public education, working on audio-visual equipment, making videotapes of uh, installations and galleries. Visitors, uh, like, it's hard to talk about visitors because you, you're doing things for the visitors, but uh, you're not really mingling with the visitors. Like, everything you do is, in, uh, is to prepare the works for the visitors to see. Well, a lot of people come up here and they look at the Impressionist paintings and uh, they don't know what they're looking at because it takes a lot of looking to know. But they're groping for something. They want to see what it's all about. And they really uh, look intensely, but they can't find it because you don't find it on a visit or two. You have to search around. And you hear a lot of people say, and they always, uh, uh, a, lot, a few people laugh at the comment, well, uh, I know what I like. Which isn't a funny comment, because they're absolutely right. It's people do know what they, what they like. doesn't seem like it has an end. It just continues. If you would start, let's say, at the uh, south wing and walk directly to the north wing in a straight line, it would be a four block walk, four city block walk. Uh, it would be interesting to know just how many doors are in the museum. How many steps would the museum have? Like, uh, if you would put all the museum steps together, how high can you go? I think you could look down on the Empire State Building for sure. There must be over 800 people working in this museum. Uh, you have uh, elevator mechanics, you have carpenters, you have um, painters, steam fitters, plumbers, restorers, designers, roofers, tinsmiths, everything is in the building. And, and these are a lot of people that you never see. Many times I work with fellows in the uh, conservation department or departmental assistants from various departments in the building when we're setting up displays or removing uh, works of art. Everybody had a job to do. Um, you have one person making the display case. You have uh, the uh, departmental assistant handling the art. You have conservation making clips and whatever it takes to hold down the art so it doesn't get knocked over while it's on display. Then you have the cleaners come to uh, clean the glass in the area around it. And then sometimes the uh, gardener comes and uh, if it's needed, he'll, he'll put a plant nearby to enhance the art. And then finally, the uh, security department sends a man over to watch it. Most of the time from 12 to 1, it depends on what type of schedule I'm following for that day and what type of programs are going on. I'll occupy my time and relieve a lot of my tensions 
with an hour's worth of uh, exercise. So this relaxes me and also benefits me physically. I was into fencing for a while, and naturally the arms and armor department, I would say spontaneously, well, this is my favorite place. The new sections in the museum that's being added on, like we just got the Lehman uh, collection open, and now we're gonna uh, shortly have the primitive art. This is additional education that I see in the future for myself. It also might mean, who knows, I might even take up a new sport. When I'm outside the museum, I'm a different person. When I'm in the museum, I'm very much more relaxed. You know, I sort of know what the situations are there. I'm a 